it's a, it's a struggle setting up the camera yeah my phone is having some troubles not my phone <coughs> and uh i wanted to share something actually it's a it's a short documentary of a three day fast yes you had me right a fast <coughs> And I felt like I should share with some of you. So this is the first day. And I'm doing water. Water fast. You don't know if it's called a water fast. And my hand is getting tired. Oh, sorry. So, to, uh, my reasons for fasting are... Just, I have some reasons to fast. And... Uh, Maybe some of you will, be, will get encouraged to do one because we encourage one another as crazy. So when you get the, the, what is it called? What is it called? When you get the, so the super mojo, so you, I don't know whether it's, I just want to boost some of you that feel like you can't. So I'll just document this is the first day. As you can see, I'm, I'm energetic. Still nothing, but uh, I'm really getting to feel close to God, and yes, my spirit is get, is beginning to get dominion over my flesh. So yes, until now I can say I'm just. It's about what time is it? I think it's three three p.m. I wish I could have started in the morning but to show you but got this idea in the evening. So day one. Good what? Let us see one another tomorrow. second day or you may say day two and uh, I'd really, really say that God had graced me with the ability to fast this long normally I never do this long I'm used to maybe doing a lunch just skip lunch and that's it and when I skip lunch I'm normally done at four p.m. So the longest I've ever done except this is when I did like a whole day and that day I felt as if I would die. Yes, but somehow this this one I've not felt the way I would feel on a one day fast. I kind of feel this energy that is in me like sustaining me and that's why I know it's Jesus Christ. So day two it has been good and uh, normal results are when now my like this prayer like th there's this booster in me that wants wants to pray i'm finding time flying so fast when i'm praying like normally when i would pray for like an hour i would feel wow so tired or or even i would feel like wait it has uh, it has gone long but now i'm doing an hour and i'm like what it was only 15 minutes, but now I think I feel like it's 15 minutes. But when I look at the time, it's one hour. <laughs> Another thing is the revelation uh, that God is giving me is just on a higher level than I would expect. Yes, my eyes are opening even more. Like the visions are heightened. The visions I'm getting are getting heightened. And the dreams too. And also... Like I, I told you, maybe some in my videos that for a long time now I've stayed for long without experiencing the presence of God and it began to worry me. And during this fast, I've begun to, I, I've begun to feel, to experience the feeling of the presence of God, the manifest presence of God. And maybe that's, those are the results of, and I'm on the second day. <clears throat> well, the, the good thing is that 
God has given me the ability, the strength to abstain from food. And to all those who are wondering, will I ever get like, this ability, this this want, this desire to go on such a long fast? Well, I was just like you. I wondered if I would be able to. I was like, oh, three days is not for me. Now, when I'm in this, I'm confident that I'll, I may even start a 21 day fast or maybe later in life, a 40 day fast. So we just encourage one another because the way I got the ability to do this one is through a friend, my friend who does this like it's nothing. He just one day wakes up, I'm doing a three day fast and he tells you after. By the way, I was offline because of such and such. And you're like, what such and such? He tells you I was fasting. Oh, you do a three-day fast. <laughs> so I, 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 I was asking him, how do you do such? How do you do such? And he just explained to me that it's just, you just stop eating. And to me, it, it seemed so huge. But when I asked God for the help, God gave me the help. And hopefully, because now it's torture to even look at food, to even smell the smell of food. It's like you're torturing yourself. Yeah, so it's beautiful that God placed these activities as a Christian so that it doesn't seem dead. So that's it to now. And right now it's like 12, 12, what? 12 p.m. And still, I'm still strong, mm -hmm. as you can see. Maybe people like... Some people feel like when you're on the second days when now you're about to die. No. First, be, in, uh, be, be, be prepared before you begin a fast. Don't begin a fast like boom. When Elijah was sleeping one day, an angel came to him and touched him. Elijah woke up. The angel told him, there, eat and drink. He came, eat. He ate the cake. He ate the, he drank the water. Then he, he went back to sleep. Then the angel came again and touched him, eat, drink, for you're going uh, to the mountain of the Lord, and it will be a great journey ahead of you. Then he tells us that Elijah went in the strength of that food for 40 days and 40 nights. That was a fast, and he was on a journey to the Lord, and a journey of seeking the Lord. So be prepared before you begin on, and uh, I'll give you what I have. That's all I have, so let's meet tomorrow. Good. that day i've really been able by the power of god and his spirit when able to in all our weaknesses so i've been able to stay longer up to my third day and it has been really a good experience i never thought i'd reach this far but the day i had some struggles is the second day yeah the second day was a real struggle especially in the Actually, in the afternoon hours, no, in the night, yeah, I used up some strength and whew, it was just great. I, my arms began to feel this tiredness that wouldn't go away. And, well, about the hunger pains, they just, somehow they would come and go. I don't know. I wouldn't struggle with them so much. They would come and go. And last night, I woke up in the middle of the night and just some weaknesses and I felt like I would not wake up. But in the third day, this morning I woke up as if I've eaten. <laughs> I love the mystery of this. Yesterday I prayed to God and I asked him, give me strength, give me strength, give me strength. My strength is done because I had done some work. This day I'm woke, uh, I've woken up like I've eaten something like there's still strength in my bones. 
Well, I've just been drinking water. Yeah. Water. That's upside down. So, this is a water fast. It's so crazy that everything that I had in mind just happened one by one. Yeah. The reasons for my fast, I had them like a list in my mind. And every one of them happened. So, I thank Jesus. And the revelations he's given me. Oh, and the experiences of his presence. Oh, I treasure those moments. And the other thing is how God became close to me. I began to hear his voice very clear. As if he is the only one speaking in a hall. The visions became so clear. Like my mind is no longer speaking because it's just thinking about food and I've just pinned it down and the only pe two people speaking is God and my spirit and another thing about this fast it has given the power of God upon my spirit I feel it so much like the power of God is on my spirit even my words I feel like they're different yeah that's how powerful this fast has been to me another thing is my oppressors all of them went away Another thing I've been experiencing, maybe this might seem crazy to some of you, but I began to see, like with my natural, with my natural eyes. I, I don't know whether most of you see this, like strange lights when you're praying. Um, you may be praying, and out of your corner of your eye, you see this light. Like physically, there's no way light can move by itself. I see white light moving like this. I'm like what <laughs> have I just seen that and not just once many times and that's how I knew that now my spiritual eyes are active yeah so it has been good drinking just water so good by be encouraged and may the same spirit of our Lord guide you the Holy Spirit in Jesus name Amen